Sesame Street, huh? Oh, yeah, I put a lot of fancy things. You got some pictures around? The kids and... made some pictures. I hung them up. Gee, it looks terrific, Big Bird. Yeah, and I keep, in, in these boxes, I keep lots of my possessions. You do? Yeah. All your I'm special here. things? Uh-oh. Yeah, look. Oh, wait. My bird seed. What's it doing down there yeah, on the I box? Know. Big Bird, you really oughtn't, you know, you really shouldn't leave your bird seed lying around like that, spilling all over. You ought to keep it in some place sort of special. It's not very neat. Well, no, I keep it in my bird's nest. That's kind of messy. You keep it in your bird's nest? Well, sure. it's it's sitting right here, Big Bird. No, well, I remember just... before I walked, uh, took my walk up Sesame Street this morning, I put it in my bird's nest. Well, Big Bird, if, if if you left it in your nest, it's not there. It's it's out here. Hey, Big Bird, do you know what that could mean? It it could mean that somebody threw it out of my nest. It could mean that, hmm. Big Bird. Hey, Big Bird, you know, I, that's really a cute little suitcase. Look Isn't at that. that Isn't cute? that nice? Look at that. <laughs> what, what, do you, what do you what, use that for? What do you keep in that, Big Bird? That little thing? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's a nice little suitcase. Wait, like, that's not big enough to even put my earmuffs in. That's not my bird, my little suitcase. Th that's not your suitcase? No, I've never seen it before. Well, Bob just took it off your it new nest. It was right next to your nest there, Big Bird. Yeah. From out of my nest? Big Bird, oh. if, if that's not your suitcase, then... Do you know what that could mean? It could mean that somebody mm -hmm. went into my nest, mm -hmm. threw my bird seed out, mm -hmm. and they left the suitcase. Mm -hmm. what? That's, that's what that could mean, Big Bird. You know, Big Bird, uh, you shouldn't go off and leave your radio on like that. No, you're going to run the batteries down, Big Bird. Or my use up a lot of electricity. I didn't leave it on. My radio is broken. Oh, well, then it must be your TV yeah, set. Yeah, it's prob probably no. your TV set. Oh, turn Birds the don't have television sets. Well, then what is that humming sound? It sounds like a TV or a radio, Big Bird. No, it sounds more like a person to me. Well, do you know what that could mean? Well, Big Bird, do you know what that could mean? It could mean that the person who threw out the bird seed and left the suitcase is still right around here. Yes, it certainly could. How do you do? Fenster's the name. Melvin Fenster. You can call me Mel, or you can call me Melvin, or you can even call me Mr. Fenster, if you like. No difference. Uh, well, but... I'm new to the neighborhood. Just moved into this nest a little while ago. Into this nice nest? Nice to meet you. Oh, yes, yeah. yes, I did. You know how hard it is to find an apartment. So I just uh, thought I'd live in this nest. Oh. Nothing here but birdseed, so I threw it out and moved right in. Say, hmm. am I mistaken, or are you a bird? I'm not a rhinoceros, mm. <laughs> and it's my nest, too. My, you're a big one, aren't you? Hmm. This is your nest, huh? You uh, live here alone? Usually. Hmm. I see. Well, Mr. Bird, I I understand. I'll just pack my bags and leave. I, I don't really mind not having a place to live. I, I, I'll find an apartment someday. Oh, but... but and, and then till then, I'll 
just sleep on the street. Oh, no, please, Mr. Finster. No, no, that's that's no. all right. Uh, no, you... I understand. Oh, I'll I just... can't send him away. No, no, I'll... I'm just uh... glad the rainy season started because I love to sleep in the rain. Oh, <coughs> oh that's... Uh, oh, you... I'm sure this cold will go away in just a month or two. Oh, Mr. Finster, you, you, you can stay. I can? Really? Oh, yeah, really. Oh, it would be my pleasure. That's wonderful. Fantastic. Martha! Jimmy! Sammy! Janice! Doris! It's okay. We can stay. Hey, Big Bird. Oh, yeah? What is all this I hear about uh, your house guests or nest guests back here, huh? Yeah, I have some. Did, did, did Susan tell you about them? Yeah, she told me about it. She's gone all over town trying to find an apartment for them. Oh, that's nice of her. Yeah, well, yeah. Well, I can appreciate that, I tell you. Well, who are mm. the people? What, who are they? What, what are their names? Well, they're, they're the Finster family. Oh, the Finster Quite family. Quite a lot of them. Well, listen, tell me something. You ever talk to these Finster people or talk to their kids or anything like that? Well, no. Not you don't talk much. to them? Oh, that's a shame, Big Bird. You ought to talk to them because that way you can find out something about them. You know what I mean? Oh, well, I already know a lot about them. Like, for instance, I can tell a lot by just listening. Listen. Yeah, it sounds like a little dog. They, yeah, got they a love dog? dogs. Oh, yeah. I see. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. It, you have to look out. He nips a little. Oh, he does? Yeah. Good, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. And that they, sounds like another dog. They do love dogs. They have a big dog. They have a big dog, too. too. You yes. mean they have two dogs? Yeah. And, and you know what Mr. Finster does for a living? No, what's that? What's he do for a living? Well... You mean, it sounds like... You hear that? Yeah. He fixes motorcycles? Yeah, that's right. Oh, he man, does. that's... Yeah, he got quite a family there. Yeah. He fixes mo- and, um... Hey, what's... what's one, of, one of their kids, I think they have six kids, uh, he, she's learning how to play the violin. She's learning how to play... Yeah. Wait a minute, she plays the violin and he... What's that? I think they're going to start a band. Another one's learning how to play the drums. You got... Wait a minute, you got a drummer and, 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 and all in your, your nest? No. A drummer and a, and a violin guy? What, 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 what's... That, that's missing, too. You mean she sings? She sings? She's crying. One kid plays violin, one kid plays a drum, and, 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 and old man, he, he, he does the motorcycles, and, 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 and they got two dogs barking. like it, Mr. Bird. A fine sign, wouldn't you say? Um, Did you read it? Well, it says, motorcycles repaired. That's a pretty nifty sign, wouldn't you say? Yeah, well, um... And what I'd like you to do is build a nice fence around the nest here so that Fluffy and Kong will have a place to play. Fluffy, Fluffy and Kong are my dogs. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, down, Fluffy. Down. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Down, Fluffy. Um... Down, Tom. Down. Down, the dog. He's a big one. Wouldn't want to get too near him if I were you, Mr. Bird. Oh, I, I, yeah. I won't. Well, I won't. You, what do you say about that fence now? Um, well, um, 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 Mr. Finster, I, I kind of like things the way they are around here already. And, and about that sign... Say no more. I understand we're in your way here, and... If we're in your way, Mr. Bird, we'll leave. Oh, well... The kids will cry a little, but no <laughs> matter. Oh, well, uh, 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 you don't have to leave, Mr. Finch. Yeah, yes, they do. Yes, they do, Big no, Bird. No, no, Susan, don't say no, that. No, well, wait a minute now, Big Bird. You didn't let me finish. Yes, they have to move, especially if you're going to move into the apartment I found for you today. You... You yeah. found an apartment for me? Yeah, and it's oh, got a terrific you... basement where you can uh, have your motorcycles repaired down there, make but, a shop out of it. But I, I didn't even ask you to find an apartment Well, for I me. know, but I knew you were looking, and I get around, so I looked for you. But, and I found this great apartment. It needs a little repair, though. You but know. you don't even know me. Well, that's all right. You know, you're going to move into the neighborhood, so I thought I'd just be neighborly. You know, um... It, it does need some repair, though, and, and Bob said that he'd be glad to come after school and help you with major repairs, and I'm going to lend you Gordon. He's a good painter, and I can make curtains if your wife needs some help. Just 
This is just wonderful, wonderful. Thank you to everybody. Oh, that's all and, right. And especially to Mr. Bird here. Hmm. Well, gee, it was nice to have you visit with me until you found this apartment. It, it was? Yeah, sure, really. Gee, Mr. Bird, you're all right. Listen, if you ever need a motorcycle repaired, you just drop on by and I'll fix it for free. Oh, boy, thank you. Well, see you later. Uh, we've got to get packed. Martha! Oh, hey, what, we, what have we here? Well, it uh, seems to be a ball of some sort. Gee, uh, doesn't seem to be anybody around here. Doesn't seem to be with anybody. Nobody seems to be with it. I guess maybe I'll just take it home with me. Hey, what are you gonna do? Uh, who, me? Uh, well, um, <clears throat> what I was thinking about doing was uh, just sort of uh, <clears throat> taking this ball home with me. What do you know about this ball? What do I know about it? Well, it, uh, it's, uh, well, it's a, uh, it's a round ball. This ball you're gonna take home is round? Mm-hmm. What else? What else? Well, it, uh, it, it's, uh, it's yellow. This ball you're gonna take home is round and yellow? Mm -hmm. And what else? What else? Well, it's, uh, <clears throat> it's, it's round, it's yellow, it's, um, it's, 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 it's rather large. Rather large, that's this what. This ball you're gonna take home is round and yellow and large? Mm -hmm. And what else? What else? Let's see, uh, this gets a little harder now. It's, uh, round and, uh, yellow and large and, uh, it's rather smooth. This ball you're gonna take home is round and yellow and large and smooth. Mm -hmm. And what else? Uh, what else? Well, that's it. That's what the ball is. It's round and yellow and large and smooth. It's something else. What else? This ball you're gonna take is round and yellow and large and smooth and mine. Whew. Oh, well, uh... <clears throat> Uh, gee, uh, I guess uh, I left out the most important part, didn't I? I'll see you around. Hey, come back here! Don't you want to play catch? Oh, gee. Okay, everybody, rub your tummy. How you doing? You out there, too. Come on, rub your tummy. Rub your tummy just like this. Rub it all day long. Rub your tummy, rub it hard. While we sing our song. Come on. Rub, 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 rub,
it's a car, airplane, and a train. Plane is number four. Yeah. Train kind of funny. <laughs> they're putting on some hats. Now they put on yeah. hats. No. Yeah, Gordon. No. Gordon. Oh, no. Gordon should be in the car. He's supposed to be in the car. Mommy should be in the train. Yeah. 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 And Bob's Bob's supposed to be in the airplane. And Bob's supposed to be in the airplane. Nope, it's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. He's trying to blast off. Keep on going one. Let me see now. Now I'm going. Bob is going to get the car. Bob is going. Nope. Nope. Bob is hopping over the right one. Uh oh, it's wrong again. No, no, no. No, no, no. You know, that's really hard. You have to be in the train. And you're going to be in the car. No, 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 no. Put it down. I think this time they'll be right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's going to hop over it again. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, look at that. Look at Bob. Yeah. Uh-oh. No. 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 Look at Vanessa's coat. Hey, Vanessa, tell me all about this coat. I bet it's suede or buckskin, right? Yeah, it's buckskin. And these are fringes? Uh-huh. What, what is this part here? Well, is they're it... buttons and buttonholes. Oh, I see. Hey, that's sharp. Is that a maxi or a midi? How It looks it, long. It's a midi. It's a midi. Hey, you'd be a good designer. That's very good looking. See her coat? Her coat's different than yours, Peter. What did you say this was? Kind of Eskimos wear? It was the kind that the Eskimos wear, with fur all around here, uh -huh. and over here at the sides, and some around the collar. Oh, I bet that's warm. That's called a parka. That's what the Eskimos call those kind of coats, a parka, and they keep you really warm. That's good for snowball fights and yeah. sliding in the park and going skiing. That's a good functional coat, especially for a boy. Oh, look. Rhonda's coat has a hood on it, too, but it's still, it's different than yours. Hers is a bright color. I like your color. What's it made of, Rhonda? Fur. That's a fur coat? Ooh. Red and orange fur. That ought to be pretty. Does the hood come up and go down, or does it, you have to wear it up all the time, or how's that no, go? No, it goes up and goes down. Uh-huh. How do, is this a maxi, or, or a regular length? It's a of, midi. That's a midi. Uh-huh. I see. You ladies are very fashion conscious. They know all about that. Let's see yours, Mayo. Oh, Mayo's coat is still another color. What, um, are the sleeves different colors than the, the body of the coat? Yeah, look at that. We saw four different people in four completely different coats. Yeah, I like them. I've got a mind, and my mind helps me with everything I do or see. My mind tells me this is a square. If I add another, it's a pair. Add four more. Stack like blocks, and I've got enough to make a box. And now I use my mind to guide, my hands to find out what's inside. It's soft and wet and sticky, too. My mind tells me that 
It is glue? Yuck. Gee, Susan, it's awful quiet over at my bird's nest. Yeah, I suppose it is. But yeah. you know what? what? It's time to say goodbye. Bye-bye. Oh. Okay. Bye. Sesame Street has been brought to you today by the letter K and by the number 8. Sesame Street has been a production of the Children's Television Workshop. This is PBS, the public broadcasting service.